Hi, Rowan. It's Dada. I know you, I don't know if you like me calling you that, but I'm going to still call you that when you're like 28 years old or 25 years old or however old. So you just turned 15. It was your birthday. And I couldn't think about what to get you for your birthday. I couldn't make it to Texas in time, but I did something really spe special. Um, I got Alice Cooper, the real Alice Cooper, to tell you a message. Really, this is really Alice Cooper. And he was a big, big rock star, and he's still a pretty big, he's still a really big rock star. He's one of the biggest rock stars there is. And some of his music is kind of cool, and you might like it. Now, he found God and Jesus more than ever. Um at some time, I don't know when, but he really believes in God and Jesus. So I knew that. So I, I got him to say some nice stuff to you. And it was after your birthday. It felt wrong to, to try to get him to say happy birthday because it was like past your birthday. So I just got him to be nice and say some things. Okay, this is really, really him, bro. And this is really him. This is Alice Cooper. I got him to say this stuff. Okay, here it is. It's, this is real. This is really real. And um, here it is. Hey, Rowan, Alice Cooper here. Well, uh, your dad, John, wanted me to talk to you. Uh, and uh, you're 15. And I was, I'm 17 myself. Uh, not at all. I'm a little older than that. Uh, but uh, my dad was a pastor. My granddad was a pastor. My wife's father is a pastor. And I grew up in the church, and then I became the prodigal son, went as far away as possible, and then I came back to the church, okay? Because I was missing my relationship with Jesus Christ. And um, you should look into that, because I got a feeling that Dad's way into it, and I think that's the best thing he's ever done, best advice he's ever given you. Anyways, uh, I'll see you in church, and I'll see you on concert, okay? Bye-bye. Okay, click like in the video, subscribe. This is John Birmingham. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. That means Jesus. Our daily bread is Jesus. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. That means when people are mean to us, to forgive them and be nice to them and kind to them. Lead us not into temptation and deliver us from evil. Keep us safe from evil, God. All the glory is God's. He has no worry about um, the anxieties and stuff that are related to our sin. We feel bad because of our sin. Our sin eventually kills all of us, our meanness and sin towards others. And God doesn't have any sin. He's, he's good. He's everything that's good. The, all the bad is, is the devil. The devil's responsible for it. He'll, he will be burning the lake of fire for all eternity. And don't get tricked by the devil or led into temptation by the devil. Okay, just be kind to others and follow God and Jesus. When you follow God and Jesus, that's... If there's any simple one thing you should do, follow God and Jesus. It's all in the Bible, in the New Testament, <clears throat> and it tells us how to really be. Okay, bye, Rowan. Bye. I love you. Bye. I love Mama. <sighs> you, Ivan, and, and your baby sister, Ayla, and Mama, and me. And you, and Ivan, and Ale, and Mama, and me. Okay, bye.